you know, I'll just kind of sum it up and then explain it, which is to have a process mm -hmm. to close, right? So at the end of the day, we don't want to lead with selling, right? And that's going to be a tip in the networking, the third part of this session, but have a process to close in the event you compel somebody, you persuade, you convince, you you show, you know, your true colors and what you're doing and how you're helping people. You're getting within proximity of the money because you're delivering a great value to somebody. So have a process to close. And what I mean by that is prior to me attending FinCon 21, I blocked out um, a couple days before the event, a couple days after the event, and during the event where I, I don't take any calls from any of my existing clients and I make it um, I make a, a separate calendar link for people that I meet at the event where they can get a little priority in terms of uh, I connect with someone on day one of FinCon 21 as I'm connecting with them we exchange uh, social media handles right emails business card how, whatever we exchange I'm going to send them a message at the event saying, hey, it was great connecting with you. Let's make day two even better than day one. Uh, when the event's over, here's my calendar link. You can set up a phone call with me and we can keep the conversation going because I know you're busy right now and we're having a ton of fun, but I want, to, I want you to keep me in mind. I didn't sell anything just yet, but I'm putting them in a position to say yes right? It was, it was welcoming, it's heartfelt, it's authentic. And then once I have them in my environment, in my ecosystem, now it's just based off skills at that point to, to close them. And it's also based on whether or not they're even qualified to become a client of mine, or I can be a referral. Here's another way to make money. You just simply yeah. refer people. If you can figure out, this is brilliant. You know, I was talking to a guy at the previous event that I was just at, the Vault Conference, he's also 25 years old, I'm 25. Guy's a giant. And we were talking, I told him what I needed, what I was looking for. Within like two minutes, the guy comes over, and he's like, hey, there's a lady over here, you gotta talk to her. And by the way, you need to talk to this, I'm like, why are you doing that? That's so nice, oh my God. He's like, we're at the Vault, man, we're networking. I'm like, you're right, my goodness, I forgot. You know, and this guy's just like connecting me. now. Whether or not he makes money, obviously it would be nice if you had a what a process to make money in those referrals. But whether you do or you don't, the gesture is is everything, right? The 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 intention behind it all is everything, and money will eventually come, regardless, right? If you if you you approach it from the heart, money follows attention, and so being able to refer people as you're talking, take notes with people. As you're networking with people, take notes, jot it down. I talked I talk to Bob, I talked to Bill, talked to Susie. Um, it looks like Susie doesn't need my help, but she might need Bob's help. Now, if I can make the connection from Susie to Bob, even if I don't get paid for that, right? Bob's gonna keep me in mind. And either he's gonna invite me to dinner on day three and cover the bill, which saves me money, and that's nice gesture, or Bob's gonna connect me to Tom, who he connected with, that could use my service, but not Bob's service. So you see how that occurred? I networked with someone that necessarily wasn't for me, but because I networked with Bob, I now connect Susie to Bob. Bob connected with Tom. They weren't really a connection, but they had a nice conversation, and he kept me in mind. He said, you know what, Tom? You gotta talk to this guy, Denzel. And boom, money was made, right? So it, you, you create the, the ecosystem, get within proximity. Those are some great money-making tips. And like I said, if you guys have any other thoughts that come to mind as I'm talking, go ahead, comment, right? Or if you're in Clubhouse, hello to Zoo and Molly that are listening. If you guys wanna come up at any point in time and, and add value, um, hey, we're here. That's what Clubhouse is here for. Those that are watching, jump on Clubhouse and you can have a conversation, have some fun. So 